Let's get a rockin'. Oh my god. That opening was amazing. I really like this opening. It's really great. Really fun, too. I like- Oh man, fuck me. It's so cute. Like, and you see the dude, like, rolling around in a thousand chairs, and, like, it's really trippy background with, like, pictures of other people. And then it, like, jump cuts to just, like, to Tejna Senpai, strutting that booty. This is great. Fantastic illusion. Fantastic indeed. Look at the pigeons. I don't know who that guy is, but, uh, this is good. I like this guy stabbing swords at this chick. God, this just looks great. Oh yeah, I love this. I hope this show is good, because that was great. Senpai, tome, 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 tome. Magical senpai. What a cutie. You are watching Math Feats Episode 4. Yet another show just like the last, Tejina Senpai or Magical Senpai, except this time with magic instead of survival. Another show about a waifu that is so obsessively dedicated to her, their hobby that it makes you fall in love with them. And that is when you realize, finally, that this show is just one of other thousand shows that have been created by God so that the weebs can finally understand that it's passion that makes a person attractive. And if Tejina Senpai keeps caring about magic, then I'll keep caring about her. Just like Hotaru and Candy, and Megumin and Explosions. Oh, and Nagatoro and Bullying. Magical Senpai is great. This show is, is actually quite fantastic. I, I'm loving episode one. It looks really fun. The colors are like on point, quite colorful, there's always like quite a bit going on in each scene. I think the voice actors work really well together, like I think this is the best male voice actor I've heard in a while, that's like main character, as he's just like, I think his, I think his comedy style works so well with uh, Tejina Senpai here. Or should I just call her Hotaru? The Gashi Kashi gang. She's really cute though. Tits are huge, you know, that's a thing. Um, I appreciate it. Big tit girls need representation too. Hashtag big tits. Hashtag mad feats. So basically the conceit of the show is that uh, Tejina Senpai shows, um, shows MC Kun, uh, she's basically showing off magic tricks and he's watching her as she fails and he laughs at them and like is put in them. Basically she ends up, he ends up as her assistant, but uh, you know, without, without him actually consenting to do so, she just kind of like recognized him and decided and was like, hey, it's my assistant. And then he's like running away. It's, it's it's really funny. I really enjoy the comedy. This is like the funniest uh, comedy show I've seen in a while. Since like last period. That show was good too. Also, so uh, basically this girl, uh, Tejina, is just very clumsy. And so like you get, you get the whole like, oh, she fell and now her tits are everywhere, you know. So, you know, if you're someone who's triggered by tits, well, get the fuck out of here. I think they knocked this first episode out of the park. The OP is like the best thing I've ever seen. It just looks so good. The show looks so polished too. The design of main character is a pretty, you know, standard, bland, but I think that's the point is just that he's supposed to be an insert. And for a self-insert, he's still just the most interesting I've ever like. Cause he, cause he actually like participates in a plot than just like your generic, uh, fucking idiot. I also really like seeing like how how obsessed with magic this girl is like whenever her knowledge about like the pigeon pigeons and stuff she's just going on and on about pigeons and then the pigeon bites her or pecks her. It's uh really cute to know that she really cares about magic. I also care about magic. I think the comedic timing in this show is just great and I don't know how to explain it or how to describe it but you should just know that it's that's a fact. Mad props to both voice actors, as I love them both. And I'm definitely keeping up with the show as it's great. You're watching episode four of Mad Feats. Oh, also, um, there's a there's another show that was supposed to have come out today, as uh, according to Mal and or my anime list, which is called Our Little Animal Committee or Ware Show Wa Ware whatever. Um, 
I could not find these shows anywhere. It may not be real. It's probably just a prank, you know. The site doesn't really look all that legit. Also, okay, I'd also like to say that there has to be a name for anime that are aiming just to have the most reaction images to perpetuate the meme culture as we are today. That is to say, anime that target becoming memes to remain popular and to push sales. Seriously guys, this is a real problem. This anime is just like, it like come on, the reaction images, they're just so good. There's like, look at, dude, every reaction on her face is memeable. This isn't fair, this is not okay. She can just do whatever she wants. There's, there's, this, there's so much power in this. Tejna Senpai, she can't be beat. She can't. Oh yeah, Edie is also pretty cute. Can't wait to see all the extra characters like the fat man and the uh, orange hair chick. Both seem good, you know. Can't wait to have more uh, straight men or not straight men in the, or people playing straight men in this show. Fire me already. Math feats forever. Okay guys, I think that's all I have to say about this show. Thanks for watching. See you next time.